With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, let us start with our question. In this question, what is given? A coil of 10 to the power minus 2 inductance carries a current of i equals to 2 sine of 100 T amperes. Now when the current is half of its maximum value, this is the maximum value to uh, this 2 ampere. Okay, then at that instant, induce uh, 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 this EMF in the coil would be equals to. Okay, so in a so basically this would be an L, uh, this uh, LR circuit. So for example, if I is equals to I naught I naught sine of omega t. Okay, if this is the value of I, then voltage would be leading uh, this current by 90 degree. So it would be V naught sine of omega t plus 90. Okay, plus 90 degree because it would be leading. Now, what is the value of I naught? We can directly see from this expression, its value is 2. What is the value of omega? Its value is 100. Now, first of all, we should calculate what is the value of the V naught. Then we will be coming to the question. Okay, so V naught in the LR circuit would be equals to what? The peak value of the voltage would be equals to uh, a peak value of the current multiplied by XL. XL. Why XL? Because it is an inductor circuit. Okay, so we have just introduced this is a multiplication sign. Okay. Uh, like uh, for a normal circuit, we will be using V equals to I into R. So in case of inductor, we will be using V naught equals to I naught into XL. So if you put the value of our I naught, I naught is what 2. Now what is XL? XL is basically omega into L. What is the value of omega? If you compare these two, omega would be equals to 100. We can directly get it by the comparison. Okay. So it would be uh, XL is omega into L. L value is 10 raised to the power minus 2. So we get this value as to be uh, 2. So we get our uh, this V would be equals to we just rewrite this as 2 sin omega t plus 90. Okay. Now we come to our question. We need to find the value of the voltage when the value of the current is half of the maximum value. So into this expression, we put the value of the current as half of the maximum value. So the peak value is 2. What is the half of 2? It is equals to 1. So in our expression, I equals to I equals to 2 sin 100 where uh, the I max is given as to be 2, we put the value of the current as half of this value that means 1. So it would be 1 equals to 2 sine of 100 T. Okay. So from this expression we can get sine of 100 T would be equals to what? Sine of 100 T would be equals to 1 by 2 and for which angle, for which value of angle is sine giving a value of 1 by 2? So we say that 100 T would be equals to 30 degrees that means pi by 6. Okay. Now this is the value of 100 T. Now we can calculate our uh, v, uh, v value. So V value, uh, if you put omega t value as to be or uh, this value as to be, V is given as to be uh, 2 sin. Omega value we know it is 100. 100 t plus 90 degrees. So we can put our value of 100 t as pi by 6. So it would be V equals to 2 sin pi by 6 plus 90. That means 30 plus 90. So sin 90 plus theta is equals to what? It is equals to cos theta with a positive sign. So it would be cos theta. Theta is pi by 6. What is the value of cos pi by 6 or cos 30? It is root 3 divided by 2. So this and this would be cancelled. Then our value of voltage would turn out to be root 3 volts. Okay. So which option would be the correct option? Root 3 volts. The correct option would be the C option. Hope you understood this solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.